First and foremost, I would like to give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Harakat Radash. I would also like to give a double honors unto my apostles and elders of Great Millstone that have taught me this truth. And I would also like to say a sincere shalom unto the hopeful elect that are scattered throughout the four winds of the earth unto the true and sincere brothers that out there that's prophesying and laboring in this truth and in this doctrine. <clears throat> unto you I say shalom. Esau's coming from all angles, all right? This devil is going to use all their resources. They control everything, okay? The one thing that they can't control is the all right? But they control all the resources. They control damn near everything, all right? You know, they're going to use all their, their resources, everything they have to their advantage in order to bring forth this new world order, all right? Civil war, all right? They're going to attack... Your, your your food, okay? They're going to attack, you know, your job. Everything that you think, you know, and, and a lot of people can see this devil's angle and see how they're coming, and they think they have the, the answer. Well, I can just store up food, or I can uh, um, hoard uh, food, or I'm going to build a shelter. And everyone got an answer, but the answer is this truth, all right? This this truth is the the refuge. The truth is this, uh, the truth, really, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, <laughs> is our help, is our guide in this time, in the times that we're coming in, all right? They're, they're, gonna, they're using the divide and conquer tactics with these migrants coming in. You know, if you've been up on the news, you heard about the situation in Aurora, Colorado, where uh, I guess a Venezuelan gang took over an apartment complex, two apartment complexes. All right, now they're in Chicago, um, you know, supposedly causing ruckus. So things are spreading, things are going to escalate quickly, all right, and Esau's sitting back orchestrating it all, all right, he's going to, you know, whether these gangs, whether the, you know, uh, the, 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 you could say the Venezuelan gangs and the domestic gangs clash or they, you know, uh, uh, link up and cause havoc, it's going to bring some chaos, it's going to bring chaos upon chaos, confusion upon confusion, and the scriptures pretty much, you know, um, give you the, 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 basically the blueprint of everything that's going to take place. Okay. With this manufactured famine, Esau has manufactured pestilence. Okay. With the, uh, these, uh, the EEE -E -E with the mosquitoes now and the, the monkey, the, the you know, the, the monkey, uh, thing going on. Okay. They're, they're going to give in, and, and at the, at the end of the day, they're going to give these people or they're giving the people right now a false sense of security and peace when the, the this this country Babylon America is internally crumbling. All right, the, the, the morale of the people is 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 lower as it's ever been. All right, the, the, you know these people these 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 generations Z these niggas ain't trying to be patriotic. They go like they're bringing forth that draft because you're going to have to draft a lot of these 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 people these Jakes these young Jakes uh uh just Gen Z in general into this war. But Esau is going to come at all angles, right where you think that you know you got it covered, and you're going to find a way out, and you're going to you, you know Jake think they're going to yikeqwab uh, the system. You can't at the end of the day, hey, you can't yik you ain't going to be able to yikeqwab this MOTB because your job, your money, basically your 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 livelihood, which is your job, all right, the money that you make is going to be tied to his his M A R K. All right, so that that's how he's really going to corner the market and, and hit you from all angles. All right, so so everyone that thinking that you know the 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 destruction, the um the famine, the pestilence is going to pass over them. That you know, hey, they, they're going to be they're going to be in, a, in for a rude awakening. All right, but those of the hopeful elect, the elect, we understand that we have to go through this. We have to go through these trying times. All right, but we have Yahweh Bashim Yahushai to lean on, to depend on. Okay, we have the knowledge and wisdom of this truth. All right, we have the uh, these uh, uh, we we understand uh, um, we're taking heed to the warning. All right, we're getting right with the Lord. We're we're, we're repenting of our sins. We're we're you know following these law, statutes, commandments to the best of our ability. All right, we're we're showing our works, showing our faith by our works. Okay, but Esau's coming, man, and they're gonna. Ain't no escaping what's to come, all right? You got to go through that straight gate or if you want to make it, all right? And, and that's what, you know, we continue to push is truth and putting this message out there that the straight gate is the only way to make it, all right? You ain't going to make it through the broad gate, okay? 
Uh, let me grab. Um, excuse me, I'm dealing with these uh, these allergies again. But um, let me get Second uh, Corinthians two and eleven. Let me start with this. For lest Satan should get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant of his devices. And Satan can get an advantage of you if you continue to trust and believe in this system. Okay, Satan will get the upper hand on you if you feel that you, if you if you trust in carnality, you trust in guns and you trust in weapons. Okay, you trust in um, thinking you can figure out a way to get out of this. All right, this this Jacob's trouble, this destruction that's coming without the Lord. All right, Satan will get advantage of you. Satan will get the upper hand on you when um, you put, you know, you you dedicate your life to serving your belly, to 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 carnal things, to riches and and fame. All right, because those are all the things that Satan it, it will feed you. Satan will uh, uh, gladly give you a a, a nigga a, a fame and stardom and, and money. All right, just to sell his soul. All right, for 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 crumbs. Okay. For we are not ignorant of, of his devices. The elect is not ignorant, all right? The hopeful elect, the ones that are on their watch, are not ignorant of Satan's devices. We understand all these tactics that this devil is using, all right? How he's going to orchestrate a civil war, all right? Civil, civil war is is written in the scriptures, all right? That how Satan is um, going to make this election draw a larger, even a, a larger divide in this country, Okay. It, uh, whether you know whether people want to believe it or not, this country is already divided. In this election, all right, it, it could possibly turn bloody. It could to possibly, you know, uh, uh, we have those, you know, those, those the great uprising of the people if one side doesn't win, and vice versa. Okay, we're, we're not ignorant that this, you know, you, you know, in the past couple of years, you had a lot of food processing plants, all right, just so, uh, suddenly go up in flames, or you got you got Kill Gates that has bought. Uh, I want to say a third or maybe uh, uh, close to 40, 40, 45 percent of the uh, farmland in the United States. All right. Where you get all the, your crops and, and food from. All right. They want to manufacture food in a laboratory. All right. We're not ignorant of all these things that Esau is, is, is pretty much doing behind the scenes. OK. And, and that's why you really man, just speaking of the food, you really got to have faith because we don't know what the hell we eating right now. All right. They put organic on stuff and we and that, that shit could be plastic. Okay, uh, let me grab this Job 9 and 24, all right, because this devil is, he's in control right now, all right, because this is his rulership, this is his time to rule, all right, uh, this is Job 9 and 24, the earth is given into the hand of the wicked, he covereth the faces of the judges thereof, if not, where and who is he, if it's not Esau, Edom, the so-called white man, doing these things, and orchestrating all this shit, who's doing it, okay, ultimately it's the most high, all right, that's using Esau on the left hand, okay, but in the flesh, down here on earth, who's making all these things happen, okay, who has the resources to change laws, who has the resources to um, to uh, 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 build or not build food processing, who has the resources to do all these things, Esau, okay, the earth is given into the hands of the wicked for, for a season, for a time, okay, for era, for eons, all right, but Esau's time is up, all right. We're, and as we get closer and closer to this, the end of this devil's reign, this rulership, you're going to see a lot of drastic changes that's going to take place. You're going to see more uprisings. You're going to see, uh, 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 you're going to see uh, uh, uprisings. You're going to see uh, uh, shortages of food. You're going to see drought, massive drought, which ultimately affects the food. Or pardon me, one second. Salakia. So you're going to see all these things taking place, and at the end of the day, the, the, everyone's going to be pointing the finger at this devil Esau. All right, because he, at the end of the day, he's being revealed. Okay, all right. At, at Esau can play this game where he got you know one side against the other, and they're going to point the finger. It's the Democrats' fault. It's the Republicans' fault. But those that have eyes to see can see the bigger picture. Like it ain't. It ain't these Democrats. It ain't the the ones that you think is running things. It's the ones above them and the ones above them, the the, the wicked elite, all right, the international um, uh, 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 international bankers, 
all right, these few families that run the world and, and hoard all the wealth or that are making these things that, 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 that have, you know, um, that have, uh, in, and just use America as a, uh, 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 um, as a, uh, a device to do it, to push their wickedness, to push their, uh, uh their new world order agenda. <laughs> all right. I had a, let me see. Second Ezra's six. Let me go to second Ezra six. And I'm going to start at, uh, verse seven. Then answered I and said, What shall be the parting asunder of the times, and when shall the, be the end of the first and the beginning of the death followeth? So not just Ezra's, but the, the disciples are always were inquiring about the end times. We're inquiring about the kingdom of heaven, when, when, when it was going to be established, when it was going to come. All right? And just like the prophet Ezra is inquiring of the angel. And he said unto me, From Abraham unto Isaac, when Jacob and Esau were born of him, Jacob's hand held first the hill of Esau. For Esau is the end of the world, and Jacob is the beginning of it that followeth. So the seed of Esau would be ruling in the end times, in the last days. So who is ruling right now? And, 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 you know, you got a lot of these bugged out Christians that don't know, they don't, 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 know, don't know too much of nothing. All right. They, they're they trying to say uh, it's the uh, Arabs. No, the, the, the Edomites, the seed of Esau will be just so-called white men, all right? And, and, and you got Edomites that live amongst us, but we're speaking of the international banking families, the Rockefellers, all right, uh, uh, the Rothschilds are, are just to name a few that, that pretty, like I said, pretty much run the world. But the end of their world, the end of their age is the beginning of Jacob, all right? The righteous seed, all right, that's going to follow, which, which, which thus brings forth the kingdom of heaven, okay? <clears throat> But all these things that this devil is orchestrating, okay, it is it, 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 it wasn't planned yesterday. It wasn't planned uh um last week. It wasn't planned, you know, ten years ago, twenty years ago. This shit been planned for, for hundreds of years. Okay? And now they have the technology, okay, and to 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 try to fulfill that new world order. All right. These devils been plan planning this. Everyone thinks that uh Seventeen seventy six was, um, you know, the, uh, 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 you know, when America was born. Well, that was when the Illuminati was first formed. Okay, that that's that, even you can go further back than that. But ever since then, they've been orchestrating and working on this new world order. All right, they, you know, using all their uh, all their resources, all the wicked devices they have. To their advantage, to um, to reach this, to reach this, uh, this, this climax uh, of, of this of this story of this uh, that Yahweh Shem Shai had put together. Okay, um, this is uh, Psalm sixty four two. Hide me from the secret secret council of the wicked, from the insurrection insurrection of the workers of iniquity. That's a secret council. All right, that 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 the wicked have that they've been planning that they you know that they they have. Uh, you know, scientists, uh, um, these, uh, the, you know, they have all these summit meetings. They, these devils don't sleep. Okay. They, they, they're, they're 24 seven doing wickedness, how to gain more control and ultimately how to fulfill, how can they fulfill their new world order by manipulating the minds of the people? All right. If they got to, you know, kill. So, and that's part of their agenda too. depopulation and they have to kill off this many people. So be it, but they're finding, they're finding ways all right, they they study the mind, they study the body. All right, so they're finding ways and they, and they look for ways to, you know, uh, 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 destroy the body. Okay, by by of course by the food, the air, the water, everything that is you think is natural in this world is is become defiled under this devil, and they use these things that which are common to us: water, air. Okay, uh, 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 you know the soil that we grow food from, they're defiling all these things in order to destroy or to kill, okay? To keep people's minds, uh, um, uh, 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 pe keep the people pretty much dumbed down, okay? Uh, verse 3, who wet their tongues like a sword and bend their bows and shoot their arrows, even bitter words, that they may shoot in secret at the perfect. Suddenly do they shoot at him and fear not. Then the perfect is, in these times, is the elect. Okay, then that's the perfect who they shoot at, and and they really want to destroy because 
the elect is what separates Esau from Esau from pretty much fulfilling their new world order. Okay, but we know that's not going to happen. Okay, we know. All right, it, it's already written how this that it's it's written how this devil ends, how this devil story ends. Okay, they encourage themselves in the evil matter. They commune of laying snares privately. They say, "Who shall see them?" And this Esau got a is if Esau has probably more snares today than they ever had. Okay, they're gonna they're gonna like I, like I said they're gonna use any and everything, all their resources to um to you know to to fulfill this new world order. All right, they, all, all the snares are coming out. All right, they search out iniquities. They accomplish a diligent search, both the inward thought of every one of them and the heart is deep. All right, they're gonna search. They they search out iniquities. They search out ways to make our people go off. They search out ways to put certain things in our food to 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 kill us. To uh, put things in our um, in our food to um, calcify our pineal glands. All right, they 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 do a they do a diligent search on uh, uh, like I said, the body, the brain, everything. Okay, um, let me grab this uh, Psalms one forty. Psalms one forty and one. To the chief musician, a psalm of David: Deliver me, O Lord, from the evil man; preserve me from the violent man, which imagine mischief in their hearts continually. All they gathered together for war. All right, and that's Esau. They they imagine mischief daily. Hourly, every second, this devil has scientists in a lab have, uh, 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 you know, wicked devices to, uh, uh, like I said, to to manipulate, to, uh, uh, you know, uh, you know, uh, manipulate behaviors. All right. This devil is, is you know, and this devil's uh, 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 intelligent demon on the left hand. OK. They have sharpened their tongues like a serpent. Adder's poison is under their lips. Or we always say the devil talks with a forked tongue. You can never believe him. Okay? It says, um, what is that? Um, they are forgers of lies. All right? And they, they, even when they tell it, even when it seems like they're telling the truth, it's a lie. Okay? Excuse me. Keep me, O Lord, from the hand of the wicked. Preserve me from the violent man whose purpose, who have purpose to overthrow my goings. And Esau is that violent man. All right, the thief cometh not but to steal, kill, and destroy. That's Esau. Okay, that's in uh, John, uh, I believe, John, the 10th chapter, 10 and 10, I believe. All right. Let me grab this. Because um, a lot of shit is coming down. A lot, a lot of things are going to come down. In, in this this election, all right, the, uh, the potential civil war, all right, it's, like I said, it's already a great divide. Uh, amongst his nation. All right, let me grab this real quick before I grab that. Mark 3 and um, 26. No, 24. If a kingdom, I, actually, I started at 23. And he, called, and he called them unto him, and he said unto them in, in parables, how can Satan cast out Satan? If a kingdom be divided, Against itself, that kingdom cannot stand. Let me get this in the NLT. NIV, excuse me. If a kingdom be, is divided against itself, that kingdom cannot stand. What was the one that said? Uh, is it the NLT? Yeah, here it is. NLT. A kingdom divided by civil war will collapse. All right, this in this place is divided. It's eventually, it's divided, and it's going to be even a greater divide once this they get, we get closer to this election, and and eventually the results of this election. All right, because Trump already said it. If if he doesn't win, it's going to be civil war, and and that may be the other way. If, if uh, Trump wins, it may be civil war the other way. Because at the end of the day, some one party is going to be mad. All right, but this is what Esau wants. Esau is orchestrating all this. Okay, they they're giving you all these. Uh, 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 this false shit in the news about, you know, this person's up in these polls and this person's up in this polls. That's just to keep your mind, you know, a lot of really to keep you niggas confused to what the hell is going on. All right. They, they really, you know, Esau does a, 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 you can say Esau does an excellent job of confusing niggas, man. All right. And, and those are the ones really the most high don't want. Okay. This is 1 Thessalonians 5 and 1. 
But of the times and the seasons, brethren, ye have no need that I write unto you. For yourselves, for yourselves know perfectly that the day of the Lord so cometh as a thief in the night. So right when everyone least expected, that's when the Lord, that's when these plagues uh, are, are going to hit. They're going to hit the hardest. All right. If you knew something was happening, if you knew something was on the, the brink of taking place, you know how to, you could, you know, at least brace for, for the impact. All right. You can prepare yourself the best way you can. But if you have no clue what the hell is going on, of course, it's going to catch you off guard like a thief in the night when you least expect it. All right. For when they shall, for when they shall say peace and safety, then sudden destruction cometh upon them as travail upon a woman with child and they shall not escape. All right. And Esau is going to use that tactic, the peace and safety tactic to make everyone feel at peace, every, make everyone think that everything is, uh, you know, back to normal. All right. And, 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 and that's when that, that, that serious wrath is going to come when. When you think everything is, you know, everything is peaceful, everything is back to how it was, and, you know, you know we're going to continue to live our life how it was, and bam, that's when the Lord, you know, going to really increase those plagues. And that's when Yahweh Shai, you know, possibly may come back in the chariots when, when that when that peace and safety uh, 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 moment comes. Oh, let me see. Y'all want to read four. But ye brethren are not in darkness, that the day should not, should overtake you as a thief. Ye are the children of light and the children of the day. We are not of the night nor of darkness. All right. So that, that's speaking of the elect. All right. The ones that are on their watch. All right. That, that are watching day and night. All right. That are on that watchtower waiting for the enemy, looking for the enemy to give the warning. And we're giving our people the, the, the clear warning right now. All right. That the enemy is coming. They're coming down with great wrath. All right. They're not going to spare anyone. All right. And really this, the Lord is going to put... A, 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 a deaf angel on this devil when really, he really comes down. All right, the, the, our people are are have are clueless. All right, they go through TikToks and Instagram videos, and they may see this stuff, but they don't think that uh, uh, these things would ever happen. All right, a, 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 a nigga in the hood, or you know, I say nigga, I'm talking about Mexican niggas, you know, Latino niggas, uh, 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 black niggas, all Jake. They have no clue what the hell is about to take place. Okay. They got robot dogs with flamethrowers, with guns. They got drones, uh, uh, one-shot kill drones. They got all this technology that Esau is going to bring forth that uh, Jacobs have no clue that these, these, this, this technology, all right, these pseudo miracles, all this shit is going to catch our people off guard, all right. Excuse me. All right, but the, the the children of light, all right, the elect that that are not in darkness, we we understand and we understand we understand the times that we're living in, all right, and, and we understand uh, how wicked this devil is, all right. We understand that this devil is uh, this devil Esau, and their uh, and, and their um, their overall agenda. Oh, let me see where was I at. I want to grab this scripture, uh, Revelation three and three. It's kind of it's the same thing. Three thief in the night. Remember there, uh, yeah, Revelation three and three. Remember therefore how thou have received and heard and hold fast and repent. All right, we, hey, remember. Damn, I should lock here. Remember therefore how thou has received and heard and hold fast and repent. Remember how you received this word. All right, and, and this word, this truth is is really nothing to play with. You should take this warning seriously. All right. And repent. It says repent. All right. Turn away from sin. All right. Turn away from your wicked deeds. Turn away from the man or the woman you were in the world and repent to the Heavenly Father. Repent to Yahweh Shem Al Shai uh, and, and get closer get closer and closer to Yahweh Shem Al Shai because in that day, this is all we got. All right. We're not depending on uh, guns, the government, the police. All right. Uh, 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 no bunkers, no shelters. We can't, we're not, we, nothing can save us. From what's to come, except Yahweh Hashem Al Shai. All right. If therefore thou shalt watch, I will come as a thief. I will come on thee as a thief, and thou shalt not know what hour I will come upon thee. So you have to watch. All right. You gotta. You gotta stay on your watch. You gotta stay. You know. You know. And you have to be occupied in prophecy, as the scripture said. In, um, what's that? Sirach, Ecclesiastes thirty nine. Uh, I think thirty nine and one. Um, I'm going to grab this Habakkuk, Habakkuk 2 and 1. 
Yeah, I think one or two. I will stand upon my watch and set me upon the tower. I will watch to see what he will say unto me and what I shall answer when I am reproved. I'm going to, hey, you got the, hey, a, a prophet, a man of the Lord, we have to stay on our watch. All right, those that follow the prophets, stay on your watch. Have your eyes open. Be circumspect of things going on around you, uh, 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 of uh, prophetic news, the news, all right? You you know, and when you, when the Lord is dealing with you, you're able to look at news and you're able to, you're able to uh, um, you know, um, what's the, what's the, what's the word? Uh, um, what is it? Chew, uh, 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 get the meat and spit out the bones. All right. You're able to, you know, navigate through the bullshit and, and get to, you know, what, 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 what's, what's really going on. Okay. But you have to, you know, you have to be alert. You have to be circumspect. You have to, you know, understand the times that we're living in. All right. And, and understand that these things are not far off as people think, as people, as people pretend. All right. People think, oh, civil war. Okay. They were maybe, maybe in five years or maybe in 10 years. Like, no, civil war could happen any minute. All right. You just need something to really have the people, um, pretty much lose it. All right. Whether it's some type of, uh, uh, um, uh, you know, some police brutality event, uh, 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 something. It's something that's going to make the people lose it, and eventually, more than likely, it's going to be orchestrated by Esau. But like I said, that's what he wants. All right, he wants these things to happen. All right, he he actually wants civil war. Okay, there, so he can bring forth a new system, so he can bring troops in, restore order. That's what Esau's about. All right, and that order is going to be his new world order, where they're going to implement a new system. All right, a uh, 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 digital ID. Everyone has to be identified now. Um, we have all these migrants in the country, so we need to have a new identification system. That's what they're pushing. That's what that's what's coming. And Esau gonna hit, like I said, like the title of this lesson. They gonna hit you from all angles. You think, oh, well, maybe I could do this, or maybe I could. Like, nah, Esau got all that shit covered. Anything on his system, on his grid, he got it covered. All right, the only ones that's gonna be able to to to, to the only ones that's gonna you know. Stand with boldness and and um and stand for righteousness is the elect. All right, everyone else is gonna tuck their tail. Oh, you know, you got a lot, a lot of you got a lot of these Israelite groups out here that don't use a name that's off on the prophecies. They're gonna fold eventually because their 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 faith is not rooted in Yahweh Shemuel Shai. Their faith is not rooted in that name. All right, and, and the name is a major part of this ministry. All right, of this truth of salvation. Okay. Let me grab that real quick. Uh, Proverbs 18 and uh, 10. Uh, 10. The name of the Lord, Yahweh, is a strong tower. The righteous runneth into it and is safe. The name of the Lord, Yahweh, by Shemuel Shah. Okay? Hey, hey, like I said, Esau is going to come at all these different angles, but Esau has no, no answer for that name. Okay? Esau has no... Esau has no answer for the elect that have faith, all right, the elect that, that are willing to die, and then some of the members of the elect that are going to die for this truth, all right, for righteousness, for, because they didn't take the MOTB, because they didn't bow the knee to bow out. Um, I want to get this in Nahum, Nahum 1 and 7. Yeah, here it is. The Lord Yahweh is good, a stronghold in the day of trouble. He knoweth them that trust in him, all right, the Lord knows them, because those are his elect, okay, is a stronghold in the day of trouble, and we're coming to a day of trouble, we're coming to a day of great despair, a, a great, a day of great judgment, Daniel 12 and 1, and at that time, Michael shall stand up, the great prince would stand for the children of thy people, and there shall be a time of trouble such as never, such as never was since there was a nation, even to that same time, and at that time, thy people shall be delivered, everyone that shall be found written in the book. Okay, it's a time of trouble. All right, the name of the Lord. Okay, it said it's a stronghold in the day of trouble. All right, that, that, that's going to, you know, uh, um, that's going to be our refuge. The name of Yahweh Bashim Shai and the wisdom that we, we, we um, the, and the wisdom of the scriptures. Okay, Isaiah 33 and uh, 6. 
and wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of thy time, strength of salvation, the fear of the Lord is his treasure, not the wisdom of this world. Not the wisdom, okay, I'm a hoard of this food and I'm going to have a bunker here and then I got a getaway plan and I'm going to do this and I'm going to go off road and I'm going to live off. All, these, all those are plans that's not going to work. Only thing that's going to work for us, hopefully elect, the elect is this truth, all right? Is the Lord that's going to defend us. Is the Lord that's going to fight for us, all right? No, nothing else is going to work, okay? We can't defeat, we can't beat this devil at his own game, Okay? We're, we're we're on his playing field, all right. We're 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 in we're in captivity, all right. Where he controls everything. The only thing that's going to save us, the only thing that will save us, is Yahweh Shai. Yahweh Shai, all right. The, 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 it's all in his name. He is the deliverer. He is the savior, okay. And he's going to save his elect from um from uh, uh from the destruction that's to come, all right. Uh, let me see what else I have. Only a few more scriptures. Uh, actually, I want to read this in the GNT because this is the part of Esau coming with that great wrath, and and, and you know, and these are the prophecies, the prophetic uh, events that are taking place globally that we have we have to be on watch for. This is Second Ezra nine and one. He answered, "Consider all the things very carefully, and when you see that some of the signs I have told you are about, to, uh, I told you about have appeared." And signs uh, um, are the prophecies, all right? Signs, tokens are synonymous uh, with prophecies. You will know that the time has come when the Most High, when the, when the Most High will bring judgment on the world He has created. There will be earthquakes, national rebellions, all right? That's civil wars, all right? That's sedition, international intrigues. Let's look up this word, intrigues. Uh, let me see, intrigues. Arouse of curiosity of interest. Uh, other people's house always intrigue. Let me see. Fascinate. Uh, what's another? Fascinate. Intrigues. Let me look this up real quick. Unstable leaders is another one. Word intrigues, curious or fascinated. No, it was man, a brother. I brought the look this word up, and uh, it says something else. It's not what they're saying. It's, it's uh, let me let me look up. The, let me look it up in the etymology real quick. I'm just looking up my phone. Here it is. Yep, intrigue to trick, deceive, cheat. All right, and that's what's going on. You're gonna have a lot of these. You already have that going on. You have a lot of these um, nations, uh, uh, um, you know, where that are um, uh, uh, um, building up to this World War Three. There's gonna be a lot of trickery going on. A lot of a lot of stabbing in the back. You just had recently um, Turkey, um, which is the, was a part of uh, NATO. Uh, yeah, the yeah, NATO. They uh put an application in to join the BRICS. All right, so that's a, that, hey, that that you know in the eyes of uh the other NATO countries, that's a that's a uh, uh this you know that's this that's uh this what is the word um it's almost like a stab in the back. Okay, so you're gonna have international intrigues, unstable leaders, and confused rulers. All right, L look at the rulers of Babylon, America right now. All right, we don't even see them. When's the last time you seen Biden? All right, and, and and Kamala Harris and Trump, that's what you got to choose from. When you see these things happen, you will know that you will know that they are what the most high have spoken about since the beginning of creation. And these things are happening. All right, and and, and you know, our people need to have a sign. What well, what more sign do you need? When everything that the scriptures is saying is taking place. All right, I mean, we know our people ain't gonna get it until the missiles come. Now our people ain't gonna get it till they're in a concentration camp. Our people not gonna get it until you know, uh, uh, um, you know, they got troops on their street, tanks on their street, and, and they just gunning everybody down. They ain't saying put your hands up, surrender, none of that. They just shooting. All right, you ain't gonna say that shit when you got drones and a uh, 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 killer robot dogs and stuff. All right, yeah, Jake, that's when Jake want to seek the prophet. It's gonna be too late. Okay. 
Uh, that was a good second. That was 15. I actually, I just want to get, let me get revelations. Because like I said, all this shit that Esau's doing, the Civil War, the attack on the food, your jobs, attacking all the resources, cashless, uh, 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 you know, going cashless, uh, 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 you know, the whole shit with the um, Venezuelan gangs, all their, you know, their, their pseudo sciences and uh, um, these pseudo miracles, um, you know, the, the, the orchestrated famines and pestilence and shit. All that shit boils down to one thing. All right, that MOTB. All right, and, and this is what this is what their ultimate goal is. Okay, uh, Re Revelation thirteen and um, verse fifteen. And he had power to give life unto the image of the beast. That the image of the beast should both speak and cause that as many would not worship the image of the beast should be killed. All right. This is literally, okay, and figuratively, because they're going to cut you off from this system. All right. If you don't bow down to that image of the beast, and that image of the beast is the image of their new world order. LGBTQ, all of that, that's that's the heavy part about it. That part, part of that new, new world order. Okay. One world government. One world currency. Cashless, a cashless currency, okay. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. a cashless, uh, a, a digital currency. Excuse me. One world, um, one world health. All right, where, where you know the who is going to tell is it, pretty much they pretty much have say so on on you know pretty much the world now, far as as far as uh, healthcare is concerned. All right, um, democracy. All right, um, Esau is going to have complete control. Uh, of of everything, all right. They damn near got complete control of all the resources. The only thing they didn't control is the people, okay. But that's the ultimate control they want, all right. Where in their mind they're gonna feel like they're a god because they can cut you off, cut you off and on when you want, when you want, all right. They can they can know your thoughts. That's the that's the level of control this devil wants, okay. That they, they can hey, uh, with that with that M A M M O T B in you, they could uh they could kill you. Okay, they they could you know, and you're you're seeing like um, you're seeing this technology, uh, uh, how Esau has evolved with this MOTB technology, how how they're gonna present it as it's something innovative, it's something that people want, people and, and shit is gonna get bad out here. People are gonna be people are gonna be begging for the for the MOTB. People are gonna be begging for the New World Order because shit is gonna be so bad that they they want any and any something something they want some relief from somewhere. They don't care where it comes from. Okay, verse 16, and he causes all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond to receive a M-A-R-K in their right hand or in their foreheads, all right? And that and that M-A-R-K is a physical device, all right? It's not none, It's not sin, all right? It, it's not a, a spiritual mark. It's none of that bullshit that I-U-I-C, uh, I-S-U-P-K, or any of these he Hebrew Israelite uh, uh, groups are telling you. It's a device that is going to be implanted, okay, anywhere in you. That's how you're going to be able to, you know, use money, uh, make transactions, all right, uh, 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 have a driver's license, go to the doctor. The basic, the basic things that you um, you're able to do now, you won't be able to do those without that device, all right. Verse 17: That no man might buy or sell, save he that had the M A R K in or the name of the beast, or the number of his name. All right. You won't be able to buy or sell without that thing. All right. And and John the Revelator, all right, saw this. He saw the vision where people couldn't buy without it. All right. So if you can't buy without it, what are you going to do? Okay. Because they let, you know, the elect, the hopeful elect, we're going to lean and depend on Yahweh Hashem Shai. If we gotta starve, we we we're gonna we're gonna um go back to the scriptures. The scriptures is a source. But the Lord said that he would provide for his uh uh, uh they would his, provide for his men, his servants, the prophets. Okay? They would have food, they would have drink, they would laugh at famine, the beasts of the earth would be at peace with them, they would have abundance. All right, and these are what was that? Uh in Second Ezra is uh what is that? You have abundance. Second Ezra is two, I believe. In Job 5, it says you would laugh at um, famine. All right, the beasts of the earth will be at peace with you. All right, so as 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 the world is the world around the hopeful elect, the elect is is, is falling. All right, the Lord is making a way for uh, his elect to to have 
uh, 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 um, the basic the, the the basic essentials, the basic needs they, that, that that they need, food, and and pretty much food, shelter, and uh, 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 um, and um, and water. Okay, and, and then because but at the end of the day, when all these things are happening, we know what time it is. We understand the times that you know, hey, salvation is that close. So, you know, the, we we're gonna be you know we're gonna be tuned in. We're gonna be in the spirit. We're gonna have to be in the spirit to make it through this time. The scripture says that. I read it in Daniel 12 at a time that has never been since there was a nation. All right? So Esau's coming. They 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 come in, you know, with whatever, any vices, you, you better, if you're an Israelite and you understand the truth and you seeking salvation, you can't have no vices in this world. You can't be tied to anything in this world because Esau is going to use that, all right, to uh, 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 try to tie you back into this world, to try to bring you back into this world. Or you got to be ready to let everything go because they're going to come. And they ain't going to play fair. They're going to come at all angles. All right? So, Lord willing, this lesson was edifying unto the elect. And I want to give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Yahweh Kakodash. Shalom.